Hi YouTube, how are you doing? And welcome to Anthology of Fear. If you remember, we played the demo for this game a really long time ago, and the demo was really good. It is a absolutely beautiful, almost hyper-realistic uh, horror game uh, with a crazy atmosphere. It's like a liminal style uh, horror game, a uh, psychological horror game, and it just came out. So I wanted to check out the full game, and I hope you guys join me. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you like the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. But let's not waste any more time. Let's hop into the game. Let's go. Hi there. Han, it's me. Sorry I'm calling this late. I hope you're doing okay. I just... I'm checking a lead. This woman claims to have worked in a mental health clinic. Says the boss had done something terrible. Claims she knows. I never knew Nate had problems like that. So she told me I'll find the answer there. And now I wish I hadn't left. But it's the strongest lead I've had. I think we are looking for our brother. I think that's the premise of the game. Oh my god, dude, look at the graphics. Hello there. It's Ethan. Are you there? I'm here. Are you sure you're not followed? Yeah. What's next? What's the voice acting? I left you something useful. There's a closet next to the trash cans. Check the drawers. Uh, press tab to see. The informant said she left something in a dresser. It's supposed to be in this alley. Hold right, must be, yeah, you, that was very interesting about this game. You could, like, basically interact with everything, uh, or, like, most things to get, like, a little, yeah, lots of plants here. Someone has to be taking care of them to get a little observation, which is interesting. Uh, also, I'm just in case there's gonna be more stuff popping up over there. I'm gonna hop you guys over in that corner. <clears throat> okay, uh, let's see, we can see our objectives that way. Uh, can we open this door? We can open the door. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm not going in there. Dude, this is cool. That's a big stone right there. Fuses, lots of them. Those are fuses, right? Okay, so we're looking for an item. I don't think I'm going to find anything here. We're looking for... The informant says she left something in a dresser. I suppose it's in this alley. Okay. Have to use flashlight. Okay, hi there. That's a good flashlight. Oh, here. I see. I was like, how are we gonna find a dresser in the middle of an alleyway? But now I see. That is definitely a dresser. Oh, my, nice. It can't be a horror game without a crowbar. <laughs> of course. You picked up a bunch of keys and a magnetic card. Dude, we just got everything. Try not to draw any attention. Who is. There's no one here. I love this environment, by the way. Holy moly. This is well done. Love the lighting, the color, as if you would have like bright red lights here. Although there's places where they do like different colored lights. I can't leave yet. Oopsie daisy. Um, like places near me. I think they do like green lights because some research said that green lights makes people feel more safe at night. So it's just like completely green, which is really weird. I, <laughs> I don't think that research uh, did a great job. Oh, you have to click. Because uh, it's creeping me the hell out whenever I walk there. We used a crowbar, I see. Oh, what's this? Do not store any personal property in the public base basements. Always, always or on the steps. Do we have a, we open some of these doors, closed shuts. We have a magnetic cart. Maybe we can open a door down here. I guess we're going into the basement. What could possibly go wrong in the basement? Is that a single-use crowbar? No, we still have it. Why is it so many? According to that woman, one of these doors will lead me to the basement. Yeah, we're already in the basement, my friend. I'm downstairs. Okay, look for the blue door. Rat poison, danger. Okay, don't eat the rat poison. Noted. Oh, closed. Okay, then. This is, the game looks this good without even like a, a film grain filter. Usually games like these do film grain, which for some reason makes the game look more, games look more realistic. Oh. Uh, that's a dark little hallway. I think I'm going to the light or should we go to the dark? Let's check out the dark first. Oh, not dark anymore. What the fuck is this motion sensor lights? It's real weird. I 
feel like we're about to be jumped. Walking down a creepy hallway. Oh. Authorized personnel only. Can we open this with a key card? I'm here. Good. Now listen. Officially, the clinic is on hold, but the building is still being maintained. Watch out for the alarm. Okay. All right, I'm digging it. To the clinic. I don't know what I expected to find. Nathan, safe and sound. An answer just left there. It's been almost two years. <laughs> I was so wrong. I like the way they're introducing the story. Okay, so Nathan, is, Nathan is probably our brother. I found the blue door. Then another, then another. My ears are ringing. I'm so close to finding them. Okay. What the heck was that? I think it was loading something because there were some frame drops. <laughs> okay, close shut. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of blue doors. I can't leave yet. Okay, well, I guess we're going in this door. You used a bunch of keys. I have to try them all one by one. Thank you guys so much for the subs, by the way. Holy shit. Oh, boy. Uh, <laughs> I guess that's why they gave us a bunch of keys. This is because there were going to be many doors. Nothing interesting. Wheelchair, you got something to say? Hopefully you won't be needing it anytime soon. I like how this is literally... What's this? Robert Sylvia complaining about her chair again. Take care of it already. T-H. Theodore? Eh? I'm in. Where will I find the archives? Abandoned insane asylum? The archives are on the sea floor. Access to upper floors is secured with the card. We have the card? There's no electricity. Can I just use the crowbar? Breaking in would set off the alarm. You'll have to turn on backup power. So where will I find this office? <laughs> it's hardly an office. It's A53. I left you the key. Okay. Let me know when you're there. Yeah, we can't use the elevator if there's no power. I need to turn on the backup power for the card readers to work. I should look for room A53. Okay. That looks very thin. I guess a human fits on that. A53. We're in the complete wrong side of the place. Because this is... <laughs> we're going to have to walk really far if we're going to have to go to 53. This is a pretty clean looking place. Given that it looks very abandoned. Like, for a hospital to, to look like this, it has to be, like, fully abandoned. I don't think they're just going to turn off the lights. You, you can't open these doors, right? That was... Oh! Did not even go to the toilet! A51! It's not the right room. Oh, that's where we came from. Oh, wait, what? It goes from A... Wait, what? That's extremely close. What is this numbering, dude? This makes no fucking sense. <laughs> these numbers are so confusing. Excuse me. Oh, here. What is the A53 doing here? A5. A21. A50. What is this fucking... <laughs> this makes no sense. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> this is the weirdest numbering of all time. Oh. Some old appliances. Okay, we need to turn on the backup power. Oh, so, you said backup power? I love this flashlight. Looks like a real flashlight. I don't know. I feel like most, like, if you compare this to, for example, the Phasmo flashlight, the Phasmo flashlight is just like a bright circle of light. That's not how real flashlights work. Real flashlights fade out, like this one. Um, what's this? D. Marco Alexander. Procedure, procedure, nerve stimulation technique. Electroencephalogram, electroculogram, electrocardiogram, finger oximetry. I don't think this sounds good at all. Results sleeping period 566 minutes. 10 minutes of sleep, onset latency, awakenings for 10 minutes, four REM phases recovered. Who is this? Is not our friend. Impression, no physical symptoms lead to a concussion. Patient need, doesn't respond to the therapy. Consider putting him on the NET, NET list. Interesting. Well, they also got a slight... Slight... Uh, fish eye lens going. I like it, I like it. Okay, we need to turn on these machines. So let's just touch the machines. Backup power, here we go. Easy as it gets. Boom, click the button. Click these switches. Can I not flick the switches? Doop, doop. Our 
was easy. Where are the archives? Can you hear me? Excuse me? Uh-oh. The power seems to be working, but the walkie-talkie isn't. The patient's archive is somewhere on the second floor. That is where I should start. Okay. Yeah, this is not creepy at all. Why are those freaking exit signs so insanely bright? Excuse me? Okay. Somewhere on the second floor. I guess we're just going back to the... Uh... Elevators. Please work. Doesn't work. Okay, well, I guess we're taking the stairs, wherever that may be. Oh, over here. We can literally just use a cart right here. I'm stupid. Okay, there we go. The very weird stairs for a hospital. This seems like a house. <laughs> this wall kind of feels like homey. Doesn't feel very hospital ish. Doesn't work. I need a different cart. Okay. I'm not going in there. Second floor. So this is the first floor. This is the second floor, I guess. Okay, we're looking for which specific room? No, wait, what? We're st still going? Does this card work? Okay, at least that card works. Uh, the door to the archives has to have a card reader. Okay. Well, I'm going to do right wall strats. This seems like employee archive. Wait, so Nate is an employee? I thought he was a patient. There are a few shelves missing. There's something down there. I want to check that out. I'm not seeing it. Maybe the documents are somewhere else. What's this? Nothing useful. Sylvia, these results are phenomenal. We don't have... We have not only made a major discovery in treatment of sleep and anxiety disorders, but also made a leap in consciousness studies. This proves to us Mark's theories were correct, that if we get an activity strong enough, we can recreate and re-record it. This is a career-making move, Sylvia. We're talking Eccles level. Get ready for celebration. It's an honor to have you by my side. I'm just gonna think it's Theodore. I don't know who that exactly is. Okay, well... That's not it. Okay, can we go for the... Uh... Okay, do we have everything here? There are shelves missing. Let me guess. The end is missing? No, the end's right here. It's not it. What is that, then? We're looking for Nath, right? I guess the shelves that we need are missing. I guess not. I'm just gonna walk. What's the worst that could happen? What the hell are you making this noise? Patient archive? Oh, yeah, yeah, we need to go to the... Wait, was it... Oh, that was the employee archive. Of course, we're looking for... Nate was a patient. I thought Nate was gonna be a... Patient in the first place. Okay, there we go. Oh. Hi there. I'm gonna operate this old-timey computer. I must be close. That's cool. <laughs> oh. What is the sound change? Addendum to contract. Employee agrees. Redacted. Posthumous hues. Redacted. Body and mind redacted. Specific purpose that benefits the employer with no legal possibility of action. Redacted. Agreement redacted. Family members redacted. <laughs> okay. Seems like a bad contract. Did we go deeper in? We used a bunch of keys. Do we have keys to every door? Okay, here we go. Of the damn archive. Good thing Soren is not a very popular name. Okay, so we're looking for Soren. That's not it. What's this? The name was Theodore! Wait, what? <laughs> Fucking good guess. <laughs> I left 367067 uh, ends tape in your office as you asked. Didn't have the key to the desk drawer, so I put it on your bookshelf. You won't miss it. Hope the high-ups can get it all sorted soon. This is Michael, obviously. M stands for Michael. Oh, yeah, you're right. Soren, here we go. Soren, Nathan, Andrew. Okay, wait, what? Soren, Nathan, Andrew? Is his name Soren, period, Nathan, Andrew? What is his name? Initial examination description. 26 or 27-year-old man signed up for NET. Uh, reports having problems staying asleep, having recurrent nightmares, irritable, trouble focusing, possible sleep apnea, reports using anti antihistamines for sleep, accompanying diseases, family history of depression, and paranoid schizophrenia. Okay. Well, damn. Okay, so we still need to find the tape. 
can't read these. I can't even crouch in this game. Uh, okay. So we, we need to go... We still need to go to the office. I left the tape on your office as you asked. Didn't have the key to unlock the desk drawer, so I put it on the bookshelf. You won't miss it. Okay, but we don't know where this office is. I guess we're just gonna go. <clears throat> Last name is always first. Okay. But so his name is Nathan Andrew Zoran, I guess. I guess he has a middle name. He's fancy like that. Oh, wait. Is that where we came from or is that door just open? Oh, that's where we came from. Head nurses. Here we go. You left it on the drawer. Doggy. Have you seen this doggy? Nothing useful. Have you seen this doggy though? Don't let your future go up in smoke. Morpheus. Morpheus Medical Center, really? Alice, could you pick up Danielle from school? I've got the late shift and Tom is out of town. Oh, I love mom. Crispy? What do you mean crispy? Oh, this plant. This plant is crispy. I was like, what the fuck is that? That's cute. That is cute. I won't find anything here. Okay. Uh, I won't find anything here. There's another note here. Can we log in with the password? Sorry, we had to leave early, but we're still on for Monday. They literally just left this in the middle of nowhere. Like, in the, just out of nowhere. They just left this whole place. Because it seems like they were just working here, no problem. And then all of a sudden, everyone's gone. Uh, <clears throat> patient. 27-year-old treated for idiopathic insomnia. What is that? <laughs> idiopathic? Nightmares lead to waking up several times during the night. Claims to have tried to treat it with antihistamines with no improvement. Family history of depression and paranoid schizophrenia. After the patient was hooked on into the equipment, he at first resisted the signal. After exactly 17 minutes and 36 seconds, the patient entered the REM phase, after which he was connected. He appeared to have been in a lone alley, empty except for two cars and a couple of mannequins. I remember this. This was a demo of the game. <laughs> Wait, we were the we were playing as the brother in the demo. The patient initially thought he has gotten into a car accident. The patient's mind seemed to create obstacles for the man to overcome. He took a crowbar from one of the mannequins to open a door leading to an elevator. The elevator was out of power, but the patient created an empty generator to which he found some gasoline. The elevator took him to a place looking like an old villa with long corridors. Here's when Dr. Hypnos began nerve stimulation, leading to closing the door to one of the chambers before the patient could get inside. The patient quickly created a key, which he found in a kitchen at the end of one of the corridors. Wait, this is really cool. They they integrate the demo into the main game by making it like something that happened to the character you're trying to find. That's that's clever. Okay, uh, so not much in this office. I guess we go to another floor. I don't know why the game would assume that I would check another floor when there is obviously many offices here, but okay. Let's check up. Maybe this opens too. This opens as well. Okay. Here we go. It's still so weird that all the lights are red. Right, I'm just looking for... I guess I could try all the doors, but I'm assuming the office that we can open is gonna have a name tag on it, like this one. Theodore Hypnos. There we go. We found it. We're looking for tape. Yeah, I can't, definitely couldn't... The tape! Are we looking for the tape? Excuse me. What's this? Dear Professor Theodore Hypnos. Hypnos. What a name, by the way. Theodore Hypnos? You're gonna be a doctor with that name. Or, or a Pokemon. Or, a, like, a Pokemon professor. Mr. McKinley has received your report from the incident. It will be an understatement to say that he did not take the news calmly. Let's just say he was... It was not you who almost got hit by a vase. Sir, M Mr. McKinley is very disappointed with your team's performance. It's been months since our scientists got any substantial data from your clinic. And days since you picked up the phone, sir. The board of directors has decided to suspend Morpheus Medical Center. That's why they abandoned it. Active immediately. Please inform your employees of this development. All of them will be pay put on paid leave. Any means of keeping this incident classified will be made... It will be on your side, sir, to ensure that. As for Mr. Shoren's family, there must be no contact with them. If any living relative learns about this incident, Mr. McKinley will no longer be able to protect you, sir, and your life's work. We insist that either you or Dr. Zhao meet us this Thursday at 2 p.m. in our Chicago office. Mr. McKinley will fly from Melbourne just for this meeting. He hopes it will be a productive use of his time. Delphine, Delphine Maria Torres. Jonathan McKinley's personal assistant. Okay, so they did some fucked up shit testing on my brother. Excuse me. Won't find anything here. 
Um, nothing useful. We can't read that. I don't think it works. Uh, I want to find... Excuse me? That's cute, indeed. We can't pick up the tape. Weren't we looking for a tape? Maybe it's in here. Oh, you picked up a box of documents, I see. I got what I wanted. There are some documents and a VHS tape. I could watch the tape on that TV on the first floor. Why would you put a tape here if I'm looking for a tape? That's the one way to put an insane red herring there. Okay. All right, I'm going to leave. Let's watch, the, watch it on the blue TV that we saw at the start when we did the backup power. I remember that. Okay, so we watched it on this television. Does it even have a tape player? Oh, here. Is that connected? There seems to be no cable. Oh. Wi-Fi, wireless, wireless VHS tape player. <laughs> oh, oh, are we gonna go into the main in the other world now? Are we gonna play the memory? So they're recording memories of some sorts. Uh oh, a buzzing. Hey there. Get out of the car. I don't remember what happened. Was there an accident? I have to find help. I need to know what's going on. I love this place. I remember this. I don't remember ever driving through this driving through this area. Shit, I don't even remember getting into what? Into my car today. I don't see anyone, but maybe I can find something to help me. Remember this hallway? <laughs> this is very pretty. I love this environment. This is why they call it a liminal game, because it's uh, a lot of people don't know, but liminal space isn't just back rooms. It's like any transitional space like this it being in like some kind of eerie state, like an empty hospital, an empty street where you would expect like people walking around. Uh... Oh, hi there. <laughs> Mannequin. I remember this from the documents. Personally, I wouldn't put a mannequin here. Also, gasoline, an ordinary fuel canister. Okay. Oh, there's another one. Feels like a dream. It's been so long since I played this. Oh. I would like to take this. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I was lucky enough to find a goddamn crowbar in the middle of fucking nowhere. Why was it even here in the first place? Never mind. I gotta open that door. Why don't we pick up the phone? What the fuck? That's cool. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. What the hell? Gotta, oh, I remember there was a door over here. Oh, there's a mannequin now. Hi there. Um. Hi. What the fuck? Wait, look at all the tests. Stay asleep? This is the dream, huh? Stay asleep. Obey. Obey. <laughs> what the fuck? Right, let's use the crowbar. I'm not sure I know this place, but why? How? That's some kind of generator. The elevator lights are on, but the panel is not working. Strange. But most likely the elevator is running on emergency power. Maybe I can restore it to full power. I should find a generator or something. Well, there's a generator right here. I don't think there's any fuel. Okay, so we just need the fuel from, from back over here. Cool street. Feels kind of, I don't know. Feels kind of Japanese. I'm not sure. I've not been in a place that looks like this. I found... I found fuel that should be enough to run the generator! Jesus fucking Christmas. A piece of garbage? It's not funny. No, it's not funny. Can you not do that? 
Why is this one broken? Just walking on the street. Because there's no one here anyway. Yeah, I'm not sure what kind of style this is. Oh, what the fuck? There we go. <laughs> now we can take the elevator. Ah! They definitely changed a lot of things. I don't remember any of this. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Nathan Andrew Soren, excuse me. Aaron, Aaron, Aaron Rye, thank you for the three months. Power, thank you for the nine. Open the door. Hi there. What the hell is this place? It's a very cool looking mansion. The elevator took me to this place. I have no idea what awaits me here, but I feel safer here than outside. The elevator won't let me go any further. So I better see if there's some, if, see if I can find some help here. Okay, so weren't we gonna get a, wait, we already got a crowbar. Oh, we lost a crowbar again. Oh, hi there. I'm just going to any room. How is this stuff still moving? It's a little creepy. I don't like it. Looks like it should have drawers, and it doesn't. Open everything for no reason at all. Resident Evil vibes. Resident Evil's out soon. Oh, hi there. What's this? Is that a fishing rod? Is that a part of a fishing rod? <laughs> Drado, thank you for the eight months, and Brittles with the 20, thank you. Shows a child in a full costume. Wonder if it means anything. Is that gonna be a puzzle? You got firewood and drawers? What the heck? Oh. It's closed shut. Excuse me. We cannot. Yeah, how did we lose the crowbar? I'm not entirely sure how that works. No buttons here. I don't know how to open it. Is this the same? The same hallway? Are we PTing? Oh, wait a minute. What the hell is this? Is there like a secret corridor in here? Oh, don't turn that off. What a weird sound for a lamp. <laughs> That's like a flashlight. Uh, let me guess. That's a hiding spot for when we get. Yeah, I don't like that at all. I'm gonna leave that open. Are they gonna be ghosts? Hi, uh, what's that wall drawing? What's the blood over there? Shit. Scared me to death. Oh, there's a flashlight and a small key. On a small key, it was lying on the table as if someone wanted to be sure to not forget about it. But based on its size, I think it should fit some door. Maybe it's worth checking out. I don't know what this is. I don't want to look at it. What the fuck, man? That's disgusting. Okay, we got a key. That's that's not yummy. It's just ketchup. <laughs> you can chandelier fell to the floor. Excuse me. Stop it. Stop all of this. Right now. This is a magic house. It's definitely a poltergeist. Uh-oh. Do you hear me? Lamp? I don't know what to expect. Maybe I should try turning this on. Wake up, Nathan. <laughs> Please. 
wake up Nathan, please. I can't turn it off. Oh, Vatican. Oh! <laughs> it was the Phasma guy. Uh, hi there. Uh, mannequin? Mannequin's there too. Mannequin's everywhere. Did you just disappear? You think that's funny? Piece of garbage. Piece of crap. Uh, can we play piano? Calm myself down. This is definitely not a place to react and relax. That's exactly what I wanted to do. The mannequin is following me. They seem like they are. Madman Ryan, thank you for the nine months. Yeah, I guess we're going. This is a hospital based dream, huh? We're dreaming about nurses. Elevator open. This might be my way out. Yeah, this is uh, totally a good idea. What are these buns, by the way? Are those flowers? Is that gum? <laughs> What can I do for you? I had an appointment. Three o'clock with Dr. Hypnos. Dr. Hypnos. What a name. You know you're in good hands when you're talking to Dr. Hypnos. Um, oh yeah. yeah. Just like last time, the elevator stopped where it wanted to. Someone has to be here. Find me. Music. Nice paintings. Sorry I haven't fixed your computer yet. Enter and numpad still work though. See you soon. Enter still works? I think I should run it. This model looks very familiar. I should run it. Try to find something. There's nothing else in here anyway. Morpheus 64, sure, boot the system. Uh, am I booting it? Is it booting? Welcome to Morpheus 64, interactive system. How can I help you? What are you? Where am I? Where am I? I was unable to retrieve the information. Error code 404. What can I do for you? My name is Max. Max Morpheus. Autonomous knowledge system. My main task is to help. What can I do for you? Uh, can you help me? Find several options for possible help. Let me analyze them. Do you want to continue? There's no other option. Sure thing. Yeah, motto 4040. Found the best solution. Find Jericho. Is this a fucking Detroit Become Human reference? Excuse me. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Excuse me? We have to find Jericho, guys. Something in here? Can we do anything else with you? I feel like it's about the ring. Interesting feeling. Okay, yeah, I can't do anything here. Find Jericho. Can we go back? There are no buttons here. I don't, it literally just opens. We're gonna meet North again. <laughs> just watch out for Connor. His name was Mux, right? M-A-K-S? Marcus? <laughs> That's fantastic. Thank you. Oh, Jericho's a holy city. Common site of pilgrimage. I see. We're back. The elevator took me to the lower floor. Looks almost identical. My guess is that it's a part of a bigger complex. Uh, why did that? Oh, there. Why did you fucked up drawings? Uh, chair. Chair. It's a perfectly normal place to put a chair. Chair. Dee doo doo dee. 
I'm playing piano. I'm Mozart. Um... Ain't? Uh, what the hell? I just looked up even though I wanted to look at this door. Yeah, no, thank you. This is literally the same exact hallway. Same exact painting, same exact decor. Picked up audio cassette number one. It's an audio cassette. I don't have anything to play this on, though. Okay, then. Oh, well, now I have. There's also a note here. So dark. Heart. That is not how a heart monitor works. Am I dead? Okay, then. What's this? Nothing. Oh, I should turn on my flash. That seems like a good idea. Hello? It's a handle. We're going deeper this time. Hi there, mannequin! You have multiple arms, or does that just look like it? Yeah, I'm going in this door. Bye. Chair. Not a chair again. The television. It doesn't seem to work. Why the couch looking at the wall? Oh. Handle in the drawer. That seems dangerous. One way to burn your house down. Uh, hi there. Yeah, don't do that shit. with this one. I guess we're going forward. I think there's something else with me here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Aw, uh, why the chair so fucked up? Broken fridge is empty. I don't know what I... Uh, what hallway just... What the frick? I'm clicking on it. Oh. Excuse me. Hey! What? 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 Stuff is changing. Totally normal dream. Don't turn on my flashlight. The hand over there now? I didn't see that hand before. Can I touch you? Uh, pretty sure that wasn't there a moment ago. That's what I said. I told you it was going to be a secret passage. Hi there, mannequin. Yeah, don't do that shit. Damn dark smoke. Thank you for the plumas. Hi. Another disturbing drawing. Don't know. What? I can't explain this stuff logically. I feel horrible and I have to get out of here. My good god, man. What the fuck? <laughs> Jesus.
Wait, we're back here? Run. Run to the elevator. The elevator open? Don't you dare. Stop! Hi. Open the elevator! Yes! Hey, the Scottish ones, what's up? Okay, totally normal. They definitely changed a lot about this. <clears throat> this was much shorter previously. Good morning, Mr. Sword. How are you feeling? I'm okay. Just a little stressed. I'm okay. Are we being woken up in the middle of our dreams and then going back to sleep or something? recognize this place. I was here, or at least somewhere, that looked exactly like this. I feel safer in here. I'd like to stay longer. Oh, yeah, this place. Back at the computer? Gonna interact with the computer again? Last time I didn't find anything useful. Worth trying again, though. Sure, boot the system. This is like the safe room. Hello? Are you gonna talk to me? You're stuck in nothing? Welcome back to the Morpheus 64 interactive system, Nathan. That's your name. You gave me this information. Did you? Did I? What is this? I was able to find an additional form of help. Do you want to continue? Yes. I detected the presence of another user. I can connect you. Another user? Yes, another user uses the Mac system. Oh, the Morpheus... What does that stand for? Um, Autonomous Knowledge System. That's what it stands for. Morpheus Autonomous Knowledge System. Um, wait, so it's called the Morpheus Autonomous Knowledge System system? That's bullshit! This doesn't make any sense! Um, at one of the higher security levels. Sure. Connection established. Please continue to start the text messenger. Convenient power switch? What the hell? Uh, continue, please. Nathan, are you there? Who are you? Not right now. Listen to me. You have to get out of here. Okay. Of course I know you, Nathan. We've met before. We don't have time for this. What is Jericho? How do you know about Jericho? You're already, you're already at its gates. Please don't go inside. Please. I, I believe you ended up in this place by accident. It had to be a mistake. Do you remember how you got here? Yeah, with the elevator? Please tell me how you got here. This is very important. I woke up here in my car. Okay, I guess that, that's that too. You had a car accident. It would explain a lot. What should I do? Where should I go? You won't like my answer, but you have to move on. You have to get to the lower levels. Just don't get stuck, please. Tell me more. Hello, Morpheus. Keep talking to me, please. The user has left the chat. <laughs> Excuse me, what? I learned nothing. At least now I know I'm not the only one here. Whoever it was, he promised to help me. All that's left is to enter the elevator. Excuse me, I just got memed on. <laughs> QPs. What the hell? Where are we going now? More hallways? You're lucky to be a part in this program. We will provide you with the best care. 
There's no need for stress. Yeah, good one. Hello? Oh, I should always forget. It's so weird you have to click on the elevator to open it. I've never had an elevator where you had to do that. That feels like completely out of whack. Uh, take a look around. I feel like I'm getting close to whatever I'm looking for. I don't know what I'll find in there. And I don't care as long as it's going to get me out of here. Um... Dead men, dead men lie among the rubbish. How many dead men are here to be punished? So many women and children among. And here's our Michael, so promising, so young. Some of them dead, some are now dying. Others lie in the corner, silently crying. Despite his young age, people said he was mad. So mercury to drugs, he wanted to add. Now, at, now dead himself too, and with a syringe in his hand. Why all of this happened, no one will understand dude what a poem amen brother it's so quiet here uh hi mannequins how are you guys doing what's your neck severed what's your mouth covered best poem of all time that related to another poem <laughs> what the fuckity what I wanted to read the poem in peace. <clears throat> dead man, dead man, swinging on a tree. How many dead man can you see? Jason is swinging right there. In life pushed and shoved. Not a good husband he was, but his daughter he loved. His wife saw it all, drowns her grief in a glass. The kid's fate was like dad's. Her corpse lies on grass. He, at least he touched some grass at the end. Then wife was third, jumped from the fourth floor. She's lonely no more. Now the family is whole. Well then. Is that a code? <laughs> uh, bloody door. Red door. Oh no. Hang in. Oh, it's just mannequins YouTube. Don't worry. You picked up the bunny statue. I have a feeling this might be useful. This is paint. Yes. Oh, that is paint? It might be paint. True, it might be paint. Yeah, it totally paint. Totally paint. Oh, another bunny statue. Picked up another one. What's this? Michael lies here. Michael lies here. Jason lies here. Oh. David lies here. Jason lies here. Okay, we need to find... Oh, God. The oh, fuck. I know it's just a dummy, but it looks damn real. You're... What? Why you look at me like that? What the fuck? Okay, we need to find another, um, another bunny. <laughs> I'm seeing things. Okay, um, guess we go back or we continue. And. Uh, why is there a hand clipping through the wall? What happened here? I don't think you want to know. Wait, Michael lies here. Jason lies here. David lies here. Looks like there's something missing here, but I've got nothing that would fit. Wait, we need to find many, many, many of these? What the fuck? Are... No, it's just a dummy, but it looks damn real. Yeah, it has eyeballs and it's looking at me. What the fuck? Okay. What is it? What is over here? Why is there a mannequin in the wall? Oh, there's another one. Okay, wait. Can we go back? What does this do? Does this fit here? We got three of them. Sure. Can we play piano? Do 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 do. That candy. 
The food is missing. Is someone here? Hi. Um, don't mind if I do check out if there's a bunny down here? Nope, no bunnies. Uh... Hope they don't start moving now. Yeah, hope I they don't. Okay, so we need to find three more bunnies, or do we need to move them? Or do we need to... Can we pick them up from this? This is a puzzle. Okay, we can pick them up, so we need to figure out where to put them. Oh, we need to... Every poem is a death situation, and we need to put the right one in the right room. I see. Okay. Understand. Okay, so we'll read the first poem. This, what is this one? Or oh, this is the poem. This is the poem we need. Okay, so let's see. Jason is hanging. Check. Uh, daughter is lying on grass. <laughs> and the wife is jumped off the fourth floor. Okay. So something jumping. So we have kid is just lying on grass. But she also... <clears throat> She also was hanging. Okay, so Jason, kid, and wife. Okay, let's see. This room, this is hanging, so this is Jason. Jason, wait, David is the kid? Wait. Jason lies here, check. Jason lies there. And we have do we know anything about stabbing? I don't think this is a, this is one of them. Are there more than... Is there like a red herring option? This is the kid? Are there more than... Let me see. No, there's only three. I'm guessing... This is the family is now whole. So I'm guessing this is going to be the mom. Which is... What? Didn't it say wife? There's no female name. It's just all male names. Excuse me? What? Oh, do we need to do the other poem? There was a previous poem about Michael with something. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. You need to go back. There's gotta be three poems total then if there's only one. That was the, obviously Jason is hanging. That's, that's solid. Um, then we need to check for more poems. Your poem over here on the wall? Are you pointing at it? No, you're not pointing at it. We're missing one poem, I think. Oh, and then this. What was this? Dead man. And, oh, yeah, here's Michael. So promising, so young. Some of them dead. Some are now dying. Others lie in the corner silently crying. Okay, so Michael is in that room with many, many people dead. Despite his young age, people said he was mad. So mercury to drugs he wanted to add. Now dead himself to... With a syringe in his hand, why all of this happened, no one will understand. Okay, so I'm guessing Michael is going to be in the big room. Now we need one more. We need another poem. Maybe in here? Aha! Aha! What the fuck? Dead man, dead man, pierced right through. How many dead men can see you? He was fucking Yoda speak over here. He was killed with cold blood. His body is part of mud. His eyes large, open and surprised. David hadn't expected to die like that. A cold blade in his heart. Now his guts are all apart. Okay, so David is the, the one stabbed by the knife. Okay. Okay. We know everything now. So David is the knife. And then Michael is the one with all the people that are dead. I see, I see, I see. I don't know why the fuck, but... This was the... Nope, that's not it. First one we got. There, check. And this is David. David lies here. And then Michael. Michael lies here. I think I heard something downstairs. We did it. There was a cassette tape in the kitchen. I didn't see that. I don't know if we can go back. I mean, we need to go downstairs anyway. Hello? <laughs> this is a ghost again.
It is a cassette tape. Wait a minute. Before we continue, we should listen to this tape. Is there gonna be another radio? Or do we keep? We probably lose this if we move on from this area. There we go. Let's tape. Play it. PT baby. Very well. We can move forward. Something backwards. Well, that was a very informative tape. Holy shit, literally didn't hear anything. <laughs> Horse Lars, thank you for the two months. Okay. Oh, hi there. Mannequin. Oh, no, the power again. Fuck me. Something doesn't want me to leave. I saw enough of these corridors already, but I have to go back and get the power back on. Stop crying! Hi there, Mannequin. That, that, that. Uh, what the fuck is going on? Some steep stairs you got in your house, man. Um. No. No growth, no heart. No vitality. No growth. No. Liveliness. Just everything not. Nothing. No essence. You found Jericho! Hooray! Oh no. We got more of these. Oh, what the fuck? The war's gone. It's some kind of diploma. The certificate acknowledges that Dr. Theodore Hypno has successfully completed the Inno Innovative Medicine Program. Special thanks from the agency th team for special discoveries in the field of sleep research. box <laughs> give us a sign how old are you nothing you found jericho wait why are all the doors disappearing wasn't there a door here before i guess nathan lies here oh is that a gun looks weird but i guess it's better than nothing do we just pick up a gun a weird gun. Gun with bunny ears. Hell yeah, brother. It's a mini crossbow. It's the same poems. Yeah, this is the same poem. Oh, yeah, that's where we got to go. Just some tall man mannequins. Can't pull the trigger. Something is blocking it. Well, fuck. Why am I even holding it then? Oh, hi there. Is this a ghost hunting game? Did I just exercise him? What the fuck? Is that gun activated by the phone ringing? Nothing happened. I think there's more of these power boxes around the place. Okay. That was easy indeed. Hi, you guys again? Uh, is there gonna be? They're crying. Is 
This is different again. It keeps changing. Dude, what is this glowy? Why is it so glowy? I guess it's oh, it's glowing off of the gun. <laughs> oh god. I just didn't realize how much blood there was. Uh, well, I guess I found them all. Hi there. What the? This was not at all I, what I expected would happen in this game. Oh god. This is me. We're suddenly playing this as a ghost. Oh, hi there. Time to get the heck out of here. Yes, indeed. Able to restore the power now. I'm sure someone is playing with me. As soon as the elevator works, I am out. Elevator down here. Wait, wasn't there supposed? To yes, maybe. Elevator. Go go. Where? Oh there. Oh, I need to wait for the phone. Aha. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> kind of cool. Fuck. Crying baby in there. The squishy child is crying. And we're gonna lose the gun. I see. It's just that it's all new to me. It's understandable. You're one of the first to participate. But please, try to relax. Any questions? Wow. What was the gun phone? I have no idea. Own charge to gun. Managed to get away from this place. This is madness. This gun, these creatures, it all seemed surreal. I must be dissociating. Dissociating? I'm safe now, I hope. Oh, we're back here? Let's go. I hope that person is still here. They're my last resort. My hope for an escape. Boot the system. waiting I'm gonna turn down the audio slightly because this room is a little loud welcome back to the Morpheus 64 interactive system I was hoping to see you again Nathan were you were hoping to see me of course I like to help you Nathan it's a pity we won't be able to meet again what do you mean another user is waiting to connect with you join the chat Connection established. Please contact the... Continue to start the text message. I am here. So happy you made it. I'm afraid I know why you're here. Anyway, I know how to get you out. Afraid? Disconnecting from yourself? Interesting. Yes, I'll explain everything, but first you must get out of here. What next? Once outside, you must pick up the phone. No matter what happens, you have to pick it up. Only then I'll be able to help you. I'll get you out of here. Very soon, it will all just be a vague memory. This is wacky. The user has left the chat. Goddamn, everyone keeps ghosting me. Doesn't open? Wait, is there a new? Oh. Good luck! Good luck to you, Nathan. See you soon. That stranger helped me. The elevator should take me outside now. I hope it is the end. Everyone keeps leaving the chat. From Fosca, by the way, thank you for the 12 months, and Nelo Kazumi, thank you for the prime. And Bell with the two months. Not at the moment. Very well. We can move forward. Rainbow, thank you for the 18. Oh, back with a gun. Unexpected. We have a gun outside now. The stranger wasn't lying. I'm actually outside. He said to pick up the phone that he would be waiting for me. I hope he can explain it all. 
Oh no, it looks darker now. <laughs> What the heck? Help! What the fuck is going on? Sayers, someone's trying to warn me! Bring the phone! Dude, this is crazy. Oh god, I missed there. Because of the phone. I think that. It's this phone, but I have to make sure I'm safe first. I can't see any more of this creature. I should check out with that phone while I still can. What in the heck? This is wild. Oh, Jesus. What? Did I just get smacked? The frick. Bonked. Uh, don't ring the phone! Whose phone is this? Turn it off, for fuck's sake. Right now! We're losing him! Oh, God. Oh. Did he... Wait, did he kill us on IRL? You die in this dream, you die in real life? Jesus fucking Christ. What have we done? Dad? Excuse me. That's the end of the date of death. Wait, he freaking died. Uh, cause of death? Auxiliary physician neglect signal interference caused by incoming phone call. Auxiliary physician ne neglect? Oh, it's interference from the incoming phone call? What the hell? <clears throat> the tape, it seems surreal. It's impossible, and yet those doctors seem to be obsessed with it. I still have the documents to go through. Thora Nathan. Thora Nathan Andrew. Procedure overnight, police somnograph. Seven awakenings. Five REM phases recorded. Sleep talking, the patient mentioned what could have been a rabbit or hare. No abnormalities, normal sinus rhythm, mean rate of 76. No ecto ectopics noted. Respiratory parameters, no abnormalities. Impression, largely normal sleep pattern. No signs of sleep apnea. No decisive reason for troubles with staying asleep. <clears throat> History of ill- Yeah, that's the same one. According mentioned Alice Hill, the same person who signed these paper, papers. Nathan's personal details. The signature looks like his too. What have got? What have you gotten yourself into now? Isn't he fucking dead? The course of the recording written down step by step, but this tape couldn't have been real. They mentioned Alice Hill, the same person who signed Nathan's paper. I saw a door to the employee archives. Maybe I'll find something there. Okay. Let's see. Which that wasn't on this was that on this floor? I think that was on this floor. Or it was on a different floor. I forgot which one. I think it was on a different floor. I think it's up. Two up. I think. Right here. Oh Jesus. Yep, definitely right. There it is. Hey Alice. I'll need to find something. Like this. Excuse me? Nothing useful. Nothing useful. I saw a door to the employee archives. Maybe I'll find something there. I guess it's with on the H hill. Uh Aha! There we go. Okay, now we watch the tele TV again. Do we have a another box of documents? Another tape. This. Uh oh, I messed up. If I want to watch the second tape, I have to restart the power. You 
tried turning it off and on again? It worked. Can I turn it back on now? I can't. I can't? I better not touch this one. Better not touch it. Oh, now I can. I see. Okay. Power's on the alarm assignment. I can keep looking. We see Alice's tape or another tape? Alice's, thank you for the sub. Okay. In loving memory, thank you for the 12 months. Hey, random, what's up? Uh, excuse me. Me underwater. The Subnautica. Mommy? Nope. Looks like thing is really good. What? going to be a beautiful day. It is? What a nice environment. Let me guess, there's gonna be stairs over here? I fucking knew it. I know this. <laughs> I know this. I mean, that was an easy guess, but I know this map. This is a bathroom. Unless it's... Yeah, here we go. Because I've played many horror games that use this exact layout. <laughs> It's this house. Okay, Eva, thank you for the nine months. This is also the... I'm not going to wake her up just yet. I'll do it when the breakfast is ready. I'm not playing as a child, unless we're a very tall child. You stop lagging. This is very pretty. He must have already left. Love the sunlight. Hi there. Morning, Mom. Yeah, Jason already left for work. He didn't tell me he had to work early. Emily is up. I have to take care of the breakfast. Here's my little prankster. Cute. We're in some kind of dream, though, because this is like... Oh, what the fuck? Oh, so it's the class. All right, breakfast time. Got some bread. I don't think it's too fresh. I mean, whose fault was that, leaving the bread out during the night? I mean, I know it's... It has a crust or whatever, but still. Make us breakfast, little buddy. All this stuff needs rearranging. The classic for today. Toasts with fried egg. I'm sure I have everything I need. Okay, egg. Toast already have. We get a plate. The egg. Get some oil first. It won't work if the stove is out. Okay, you piece of garbage. Yeah, I better wait for... The There's just oil already in there? Um, now do we cut some bread? I mean, there's already toast here. I guess it's fine. A clean plate. Where would you hide? Right behind it. Is there a dishwasher? Clean plate. I see plates up there. Oh, I see clean plates right there. This one is for Emily. Alright. Better wait for the oil to heat up. Should I not put oil in there? The pan is probably heated up. Okay, well... Dude, this is gonna stick like crazy. I mean, I guess there was oil in there. It sounds like there was. Good instant omelette. Hey there. How you doing? Good. Making egg without oil. Difficulty impossible. It'll be ready any moment. This toast is not going to be hot anymore. The egg should be ready now. Yeah, you know how you know when your eggs are ready? When they stop when this oil stops making a noise. That doesn't make any fucking sense. <laughs> All done. Perfect plate. Just grab the damn toast. Oh! I died to try to click that before. It didn't do anything. Okay, there we go. Uh, do we need another plate? These are clean. I'll have to remember to put them in the cupboard after breakfast. Okay, well now I have to wait for the damn toast to get ready. He's not toasted it yet. I thought it was already... I, did, I mean, I didn't put it in there. Also, this... I hate cutting bread. I'm so bad at cutting bread. I always buy the pre-sliced bread, because I can't... I can't cut... Cut... Uh, to save my own life. What the... There's, like, cinnamon bread. That's fancy as hell. Picked up toast. 
Pick up. Not taking it out with my bare hands. There must be a spatula there somewhere. You know how normal people do this? They like shove the egg by rotating the pan. But anyway, okay. Uh, not in there. That's for sure. Ah. There you go. All done. That looks pretty freaking delish, though. Breakfast is ready. I'll make us tea in a moment. No need to turn it on now. Okay, I guess we're not making tea right now. That looks yum yum. My little prankster. You want the food? There you go. Thanks. It Thanks. Looks delicious. Why are you a robot? Are you a robot child? I'll make you tea in a moment. I have to grab something first. Screw it. Tea can wait. Emily wants to paint. We'll paint. Okay. Paint in the basement, maybe? Dark cold with no reason to go down there. Um. Looking for paint? Gold bullet. Can we play some music? Never too many. There's music. Oh boy. Peaceful music. Gonna be... Paint anywhere? Oh, they got a... Emily loves it. If it weren't for her eagerness to draw, she'd be put... She'd be in front of the TV the whole day. Many books, too little time. We all know that. Turn on the TV. I don't really have time for watching TV. Now I still need to do some chores before leaving for work. Right, I'm gonna turn this off just in case it's. Can I even turn it off? I can't. Okay, there. Just in case it's copyrighted and the rest of the whole video is gonna be muted. That would be unfortunate. <laughs> Not now, not again. Where's Emily? I have to get her. Excuse me. Basement? What the fuck? Open the basement. Video. I'm sorry, Alice. I was trying to change. To get help. I was trying to love both of you. I'm trying to find a meaning to all of this. But I can't. Nobody would hear my pleas. She's just a child. I don't want her to think that it was her fault. Tell her it's not. Tell her daddy will always be with her. No! I saw you suffering with me. Fading away as you were losing your husband. I don't want her growing up suffering too. I want a better future for you. I knew you would never let me go. I want you to remember. It's not because of you. You did. And what is it? Everything. <laughs> oh no, I know what. Mommy? What happened? Uh oh. Why is it on the radio? Why are you no! <laughs> Feels bad. Oh wait, I can move. Alright, I was. Oh, hi there. This is dark. Oh! What the hell? Emily? Oh, is it elevator? Well, I guess we're going. Excuse me. Holy shit, that was very well done, albeit extremely dark. <laughs> the kid got ghost evented. It's like, why am I looking at the seat? Uh, floating? I can't kick it around. I have to find her. Why don't you love me? Why the fuck did you leave her? How am I supposed to explain this to a child? This is too dark. This is a terrible situation. This is a surefire, no assholes here. Every life sucks. Uh, stuff is floating. Totally normal. Hi there. Oh. oh, we need to take a right picture. We need to... I remember this. I can't move this. I remember this took me like forever because I was stupid. Uh, we need to make Emily or something, I think. Need 
to find these things. Oh boy. Mommy, look at the white bunny. It's shining. Did it just change or am I crazy? Picked up toy brick. We need four of those total. Stuff gonna change when I walk back here. It, yeah, it blinked. We are the dead. Oh no. Wait, no. Why don't you love me? Why the fuck did you leave her? How am I so- No, we are the- the mom. Okay, well we got- We need more. You're not going there. Where are you? Okay, we need to find more. There's probably gonna be back here. I don't think the kiddo died. Any blocks? Give me the blocks. There's gotta be a block here. The computer, or the game computer. Um, in here, maybe? Oh, I can actually open that. Oh, boy. Can you go back? Just leave? Goodbye. No. <laughs> okay, wait, there's gotta be a block here, though, right? Gotta be a block everywhere. What's this? Your life is meaningless. Excuse me. What the hell? Don't say that. Thank you. But I guess we continue onwards. Let's do let's, let's, we look in here or something? I'm blind. How are we missing two of these? Oh, because there's one hiding right beneath it. Okay, so they can hide inside of these. So let's see. Are they inside any drawers around here? Maybe in this one? Yes, there we go. I see. Okay, now we need to... Emily? There you go. Where are you? noises oh duh i saw some shadow it's not the time yet at the peds hate those hate those with a passion oh don't blink at me you creep dark hallway why not just a dark <laughs> dead end hallway also what the hell why do you not love me? I love you. Why do you not love me? Why the fuck did you leave us? That coward who left Emily. This you bastard. People sad. Oh, uh, don't do that. Let's turn off my flashlight. Oh, hi there, eyeball! <laughs> Good to see you again. Can I poke you? It is totally not creepy and what the hell. Take a screenshot. Okay. It doesn't make sense. Uh, we need to find notes. Can we turn on the damn flashlight, please? Can we read something? Why don't you love me? Damn, man. Too dark. Can we click on the creepy eye? Do you eye? remember? Do you remember Alice? What happened to Emily? Do you remember? Oh god. What rem what remember happened to Emily? Alice? What happened to Emily? Oh no. There doesn't seem to be anything around here. Just backtrack? Oh. I'm like trying to find stuff because obviously we need to do some kind of puzzle here. Uh, but I'm trying to find what the hell we gotta put there. But it doesn't seem to be here at all. Unless it's this. Do you remember? Shh. 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 What happened to Emily? Okay. Closed. 
Uh, I saw grandma. Ghost grandma. Nice wallpaper. Okay, so we need to find pictures of some sort. Candles are going on as I'm walking past. Baby again? Oh, baby, please. Oh, what? Did you just take a picture of me? Not the time yet. Crying. Oh, she's so big in a picture of me. Do mm. you remember? Turn off the TV. How could you leave us? Um, okay. This who I remember. Hello, physics mechan physic mechanics. Uh, we can't turn this. Okay, we need to interact with this. Once I know upon a time, song. there was a little girl. Oh, Emily here we go. The story. Remember this. With her brushes, she would swirl. Painting was her world, art always in her mind. Aww. She loved animals big and small, no matter of what kind. One day a big storm came and a scary thunder roared. Gladly her best friend was there so she could be her ward. And so our girl wouldn't be scared, the friend invited her to play. And with that little help, the fear of thunder went away. Then, a loud rumble was heard, everything went blank around. Screaming was loud in the house, and then a crying sound. But this time it wasn't her crying. It was the mom's crying? Okay, so we need to remember the order that story happened in. So we can recite it on the wall. We can play that again, but we're gonna need to find the, the things first. Do you remember? Here we go. So she loved art, yes. Uh, what the fuck? Oh, TV disappeared. Oh, oh Jesus Christ. Oh, there's another one. Thunder. TV? Oh, she was playing games? Do I need to, can I get rid of the TV? I can't. We only needed four of these. Um. Oh, Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Hello there. Oh, there's the last one. Jesus Christ, blinking. I remember something. You picked up a drawing. Okay, so now we need... Stop turning off my lights. We go in here and we put the... The drawings in order. Okay, so we... She was drawing... I think we need to listen to it again. Oh. Wait, I can't leave this room anymore. Excuse me? How do I replay this... The, the, the story? Am I supposed to remember it first try? Excuse me. I'm not that big of a genius. Uh. Can read the story here? Oh, here we go. A big storm. Okay. A big storm came and a scary thunder roared. And so our girl wouldn't be scared. I think that's the first one. Oh. And a loud rumble was heard and everything went black around. So painting was her world, I think, is the first one. Then a big storm came and a scary thunder roared. Then this and this. Yes. 
Imagine if you didn't pay attention there. You would have been fucked. Uh, I remembered. Great. You remember your child. Am I supposed to congratulate you? Now tell me, Alice. Do you remember me? Do you remember that day? You were confused. Yeah, because there's a giant and apple in my bathroom. Then, the sun just set. The storm got too quiet. And then you saw me. It was your fault. And it was her fault, too. You both made me do this. Remember? Remember who you are, Simba. This <laughs> is always just... Any, every time I hear a deep voice saying remember. Uh, yeah, this is totally fine. Can I turn on my flashlight, please? Jesus Christmas, I can't see shit. You gonna walk down here? Oh. What have I done? Music? <laughs> Excuse me? Are we just back? What? Good, nice music. Hi there. I feel like I need to spend every spare second with her. I need to spend every second with her. A real work of art. All this mess was worth it. Nice music. Can we paint? I can't stand up. Hi there, can we talk? Can I talk to you? Can I help you? Can I paint? Can I do anything at all? Oh. Aha. I'm hiding <laughs> first. Oh. Go to the bathroom and don't peek. Okay. Emily wants to play hide and seek. Time to count. He's running. One, two, three. More break ins in the city. What a mess. And 11, 12. About to make a dentist appointment for Emily? That's a big tooth tube of toothpaste. 20, 21, 22. Okay. <laughs> Pretty sure I know where she went, and I'm pretty sure this little trickster will find a way to surprise me anyway. <clears throat> Dark cold with no reason to go down there. Maybe Emily went down there. She's gonna be in the closet. Nice music. Are you in your own room? Are you being as sneaky? Ah, oh, never mind. Under the bed. Hey! You're, you're running around, you sneak? You went to the basement, didn't you? Are you in the... F How the fuck... She's upstairs with a prankster, dude. What is this FPS? What is this? It's, it's running at 90 FPS, but there's this insane screen tearing going on. I don't know if you can see it. Almost growing out of it. At this rate, we'll be needing a new bed soon. And okay, now it's better. I can't. How is she avoiding me? Is she? Stupid Alice! That is not how 
It really was. What the hell? Oh. About me. Isn't about me? Are you fucking stupid, Alice? Oh. What the hell? Oh, uh, this is crazy. Well then. <laughs> Good God, man. This game is cursed as hell. <laughs> Where is she? I was watching her all the time. She has to be here somewhere. Oh. Uh, yeah, more. Okay, then. music and open that uh hello can i open this oh i don't like this just opened no again go back find the eyes over here where we just came from excuse me so did this open nope Honey, you left your rabbit here. Mom? Yeah, 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 okay. Where the fuck do I find these eyes? Excuse me. Can't open the door. Can't open both these. Didn't I already check all the drawers? I can't open this one. Oh, this? Spoon? You picked up spoon? What does the spoon have to do? Do I have to... Spoon? What about spoon? Oh, now the door open. Oh god, what the fuck? Oh no, are you kidding me? Do I have to get eyes? Oh Jesus, what the fuck? Oh god, you're what the hell? Looks like someone had already gotten his eyes. Don't worry, we'll find some. What the fuck? Oh no. Oh no. Yucky bucky. Spoon. Don't do the spoon. You picked up human eyes. Oh, Jeebus. Jeebity Jeebus. Yep, that's not uh, completely cursed. Please give me your booty. <laughs> what a pin. <laughs> oh, God. To use human eyes. <laughs> that was a misclick. <laughs> Sorry, that was just really fucking funny. <laughs> okay, well we gave him eyes. <laughs> Doesn't that? Are we gonna take so much teeth now? Oh goodness. Are you kidding me? Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, good God, man. Here you go. Yeah, that's totally not Christmas. Mr. Rabbit surely likes some new teeth. Mr. Rabbit says thank you too. So cursed. He says he will find you later to thank you, Dad. Oh, hi there. Uh, monster. <laughs> what the frick? Honey, you left your rabbit here. 
It's actually a really cool game. I'm very invested. Television. What's this? Picked up half of a bunny statue. You're a coward. Excuse me. And open that door. You left Emily, you bastard. That was mean. Why are you like this? Where are you? I can't see you. Well, oh, there's another one. I remember something. What do you remember? Uh, just empty mails, excuse me. It's not the time yet. We have a bunny statue. Music. Hello? I have a bunny. Do I give someone the bunny? You want the bunny? Oh, the shadow of the bunny is still here. Excuse me. But there's no bunny. What? That's weird. Do we give it to these? Mr. Rabbit. Yeah, yeah, we already got the teeth. <clears throat> yep. Okay. Well, goodbye. We have two halves of a rabbit. As we check over. Oh, maybe this guy. Honey, you left Mr. Rabbit here. There's darkness. Not the time yet. What are you talking about? Where do I want this? Maybe we can open this now? To oh, I see. Sometimes it's a little confusing what to do. What does it say? It is not in my style? Is that what it said? It is not in my style. What the fuck? I C I U S. What is it saying? News. B I C I U S. Oh, I can look at it. I was like, do I have to listen? Here we go. E B I C I E D C U's E D C U's E D C U's. E D C U S. What is that? U S. Analyty. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay, so there's things. Oh, I see. Okay, what was the problem? It was definitely this. And stool. Uh -oh. Well then, what happened to me? Oh. Handles. I hear crying again. Is it the the meat? Back. It's moved. Hi. Oh, power. <laughs> oh, God, what the fuck? How did that happen? Wake up, bunny! Jesus Christ! What the hell, man? Is it time now? Not the time yet, huh? Still not the time. Oh, okay. Hi there. The flashlight is broken. Oh, we can go in here now. Oh, the eyeball's back. Hi there, eyeball. That is totally not cursed. <laughs> Look at the blood vessels on the eyeball. <laughs> Fuck, I love this shot. <laughs> Hi. She told me 
Alice. Did Mr. Rabbit like your gift? Why do you keep pretending you don't care for me anymore? You're lying to yourself. Still having problems with memory? Oh, Alice. Why would you think I'd want something that already belonged to me? Prove you still care. Give me something real. Uh, show me how you smile. Uh-oh. Oh, God. What am I doing? Oh, Jesus. Oh, goodness. Oh, wait. I'm moving up and down with the... With the mouse. Jack, yikes. That's a lot of teeth. Ow. Jesus Christ. Video game. Emily's afraid of the storm. I have to distract her. Hi there. Oh, this actually. I love this. I love the lighting in this game. Can we play? She loves this game. She loves the tank game. Shoot to shoot. I want to play too. Can we join? Multiplayer? What are we doing? Oh! Oh, here we go. Oh god. Oh, we're winning! Let's go! Boom! Wait, wait, do I do two players? Oh, I have two- wait. Am I doing two players? I'm so unsure what's going on. I'm, like, shooting the one guy. I think Emily is shooting the left and I'm shooting the right. No, I missed. We're getting minus score. Why am I so bad? What am I supposed to do? I'm shooting as many as I can. Why do we have minus 400 score? What am I doing wrong? <laughs> I don't think I can move this. Oh God. Uh, all right, Emily, I suck at this game. There's way too many of these. What the fuck? What's happening? Did we stop playing? He loves this game. Yeah, I love it too. Although I suck at it, apparently. Oh, God. Oh, Emily, I'm sorry. It's a fuse. They're in the basement. Jason would usually take care of them, but he's still not home. It's too dark. I have to get the flashlight from the drawer. Okay. Oh, why did the you turn around like that? What the fuck was that? Oh boy, here we go. This is also the confabulation house, remember? Um, I'm stuck now. Oh god. Well, I guess I go here. Oh no! Don't look, YouTube. Uh oh. <laughs> Jesus. Oh no. Well, well, well. Floating. What? No, 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 uh, dialogue? Oh, elevator! It's very foggy here. Holy shit. Do I remember? Empty? Mom? What is Dad doing? Uh oh. 
kissing? Why are you mad at him? It's not his fault, he's sad. No. Alice? I'm really sorry about Jason. I know it must be hard for you, but... But you have to get back to work. We can't afford you to do this. Dr. Hypnos is asking about you. Can I bring Emily? Dang it. This is too real. Game too real. Oh. Good to see you back, Alice. We have the next patient at 3 p.m. He's here for NET. Jane will fill you in. Okay, we're almost ready. Please turn your phones off. Chop, chop. Oh no, the phone. Wait, what? Now, let's begin. This what happened? This is not me. with you. She shouldn't stay alone. We start in 15 minutes. Take Emily to Sylvia's office. She can look after her. What the heck? Mom, can we go to the bathroom? I think I'm gonna throw up. Oh god. I love the name Emily, by the way. It's like my favorite mill name. Oh god. Hi there. Jesus. Loading. This is actually crazy. It's so good. <laughs> Wasn't Sophia? No, Emily and Sophia. But the Dutch version of Sophie. Not the PH one with an F. Ah, uh, there's. Jane will take you to your house. Give her the key. Someone mentioned we need to cover this spot. Uh oh. Um. Oh. Darkness. What the hell, man? <laughs> <laughs> really telling a dark story here. Davis. We need to cover this up? What were they covering up? Did Jason die in the hospital instead? Oh, hi there. Can't move. Oh. Wait, I'm Emily now? Oh yeah, we're, we're small. Someone downstairs making a lot of noise. Is that mom? She told me she would be later tonight. So if it's not mom, then who? Oh no. Don't tell me she found Jason. That would be so sad. Mom? Is it her? Oh. The word oh no, is it for Oh god, what the hell? What the fuck? Uh, are you kidding me? I'm just here. I don't know these men. I don't know them. Mom, come back. I'm scared. Hide in the closet. Oh no. Home invasion? The break is from the paper. Oh no. Yeah, come on. Why would they kill someone? Why would they kill a child, you absolute psychopath? How, why is this kid late tonight at home? By themselves. You think they saw our faces? It's dark. No cops. Oh no. Well, now I did. No 
your witness. I'm not going to jail because it's some goddamn bra. What the fuck, dude? I don't remember a name. Are you kidding me? This is insane. Uh, holy shit! What the fuck? <laughs> That's insane! <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck? Holy shit! Jesus Christ! That's what. Just wear a fucking mask. Like, what is your problem? Just wear gloves and a mask and don't say each other's name, you idiots. You don't have to kill a child. Are right there? What the fuck? It's a nice place. It's nice today. Perfect for a walk. What do you think? Hey, Bus. So you are. I hope you read my letter. I can't expect you to even begin to understand. You're as clueless as our child. She and Emily got caught in the crossfire. Same for you, too. I see you've decided. So, see you soon. Da, da, da. Oh, this is the poem. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Uh oh. I'm to touch grass. <laughs> Dude. Damn. Holy shit. <laughs> Alice Hale. Cause of death, spinal cord injury and brain hypoxia. 11.57 a.m. Holy shit. Oh, we're back here now. Was that a dream or was that real? Those tapes must be some kind of joke. There's no way they're real, but they look so realistic. And those doctors were treating them like they were important. Good God. I need to check the documents first. History of illness. The body of Alice Hill has undergone NET. Patient was unresponsive, had several broken bones and several severe internal bleeding. Body was transported quickly enough to successfully perform transfer. Further recommended examination. Further tests on a a Alice Hill's copy. I don't know what to believe anymore. So this woman was a nurse here. She was hit there during the procedure. With the head nurse's room. I see some references to some research, but the documents are incomplete. There's a note that the rest of the papers have been moved to the head nurse's room. Well, we've been there before. I think that was on this floor? No, it was on the upper floor. I think it was on the same floor as... Was it? No, it was on this floor. Wasn't it? I'm, I'm just not sure anymore. It was somewhere... Maybe it was the upper floor. Was it upstairs? I think it was upstairs. I just, I don't think it was, was it at the archive room? I think it was in the archive floor. The employee archive area. We can't open this one, right? No, we can't still not do that one. Over here, this one. Yes. Must be this room. The note said that the rest of the document should be here. Is. Won't find anything here. How about you try at least? Excuse me. How do you know? Just some office equipment. 
Sorry, we have to leave early. Still on for Monday. Alice. Oh, Alice. Yes, of course. Um, these drawers, maybe? On a drawing! <laughs> no! No. Okay, what the fuck? I'm blind. This, maybe? Empty boxes and other trash. Uh... Nothing useful. Can I open these? Aha! What? What does it say? Unexpected Nathan Andrew NET result medically unexpected death No parameters auxiliary physician neglect signal interference caused by incoming phone call <clears throat> Uh oh Doggy Open these with a the key? New? You have a new key? What do we do with that? Doggy. That's cute. Um. New key? Food. Someone's here. I have to go. Leave, 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 leave. What are they doing here? Am I about to get shot? Is it, oh. Oh god. Is this is another break in? What are you doing? Don't stand here. What is what's your plan? They're gonna see you! You have a gun? I think that Oh you fucking idiot. Open the door! I'm not sorry. I can't go this way. Okay, go, go, go. Oh! Go! Oh, dude! Oh, God. What the hell? Don't you do What? I ran so fast. Did I lose? What? Why would you just shoot someone running away? What the fuck? It's exactly how I remember it. Yeah. Something wrong? When I die, when I... Will you scatter my ashes here? <laughs> Aren't you too young, Nate? For fuck's sake, are you recording this? Yep. Wanted to commemorate the moment. Ah, fuck you. Oh, fuck you. For real, though. Will you? I promise. What in the heckity deckity what? What the fuck? What do you mean? What? I don't understand. <laughs> Wait, what does that mean? <laughs> Wait, what? Did we go back? Are, are we in the dream? I'm a little confused. <laughs> okay, so I'm guess I don't know what that end was about. Like, if we just got shot there and we lit, we died. Like, okay, I understand. Like, everyone dies in the game. I don't understand what the ending means. We we promised to bring Nathan's ashes somewhere. And then we go back to the hallway from Nathan's dream. Because if I understand correctly, Nathan... Nathan had, like, crazy dream. Or had, like, dream problems, came to the facility, 
and got killed there by a phone call or by his nightmares of some sort. And then the other one was Alice Hill, who came to the hospital after jumping out the window and dying. So I guess they were interested. So while Alice was in coma, maybe she relived those memories because it was a sleep facility, right? So I think they were interested in Nathan's and Alice's memories. So Na Alice must have been in some kind of coma and was reliving the dreams of her, like what happened to her with Jason doing the thing I can't say on YouTube and then uh, Emily getting shot during a home invasion, which is insane. So <laughs> crazy. And then I don't understand, don't understand why we, like we got killed and then we got captured. Maybe that's what happened. Maybe we got shot and then we got sent to the sleep facility and we were experimented upon. Maybe that's what the ending means. Maybe we are the next experiment. I think that's what it means. Because all of them were like met people with fucked up memories, but I don't know what our, what our trauma is and what our experiment is gonna look like. But anyway, still extremely cool. A little bit of an abrupt ending, but what the hell? Very, very disturbing and dark. Uh, but a beautiful game. Uh, and I actually kind of like the way they tell the story. It was very, very unique. Uh, obviously, a lot of a walking sim, but I still still thought it was pretty good. Let me know what you thought. I hope you enjoyed that, even though it was dark. If you're not subscribed, please do so. If you liked the video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. And if you want to join the love, the game is here in chat. You join us over at twitch.tv slash or Click the link in the description down below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye.